It always brings a moment of reflection when a favorite movie star passes away and you think of how much you enjoyed their performances. And then there are the pop singers who leave this life much too early, their catchy tunes still playing around the edges of your mind. What I find disturbing is the number of times we hear of a celebrity death linked with the term had been fighting addictions for years or how they'd been in and out of rehab or hearing how they had a drug dependency. How often do you hear about their drug dealer being arrested and taken to trial? Well, maybe unless it's a doctor who's accused of crossing the line. And it's not just celebrities. What about all the people who died this year of fentanyl or other overdoses? Why are their dealers not immediately arrested? Like the famous the friends of the unknown Albertans who died may well know who the dealer is, yet do they ever get turned into police? Why is it that friends can cry for those who are gone, but don't cry out about the dealers who contributed to their demise? Let me know what you think about that. I'm Bob Layton.